Howdy amigos, welcome back to the ranch. Today I'm going to take you on a little field trip. We're going to run down the road to one of my favorite Texas towns. Saddle up, let's ride. That's right, we're not fake county anymore, Toto. We are in the county of Lavaca, Shiner, Texas. More specifically, we're at the Spetzel Brewery in Shiner, Texas. This is that place they make Shiner beer. Surprisingly, these guys are probably the oldest independently distributed craft brewer in the whole Estados Unidos, as they say in South Texas. Definitely the largest craft brewer in the state of Texas. Population here in Shiner, kind of interesting, only 2,154 people, calendar year 2021, and it's not growing. But it's a heck of a place to be. Well, we're not here to drink beer. We're not even here to see the brewery. Why don't we check in with Ryan, Lady, and Chloe and see exactly what's going on? What's that smell in the air, Lady? Is it success? It's beer. It is beer. So the deal is, you finish the race, you get four free beers. Which I don't even drink. I can't imagine running a half marathon and then, and then drinking, drinking beers. Four beers. That would, I think it might kill me. I would die. I would die too. You would have to pick me up and throw me in the truck. You know, you're welcome to have four beers after your half marathon, but <laughs> I would probably recommend against it. No, I wouldn't. <laughs> yeah, I'm good. Yeah. She's crazy. She's absolutely insane. By now, you may have guessed it. These ladies are here for the 12th annual Shiner Beer Run. What does that mean? Well, they're going to run 13.1 miles. That's a half marathon around Lavaca County and through Shiner, Texas. On the way here, I asked Lady, I said, Lady, why are you going to run a half marathon? Why do you do this to yourself? Why do you run every day? And she said, well, I want to have a good quality of life when I'm older and this is one way to do it. And then I said, no, seriously. She said, well, I like pizza. And I want to eat a lot of pizza. And if I run, I don't have to worry about it. Well, the guy in the funny hat, well, he started talking. So I think everything's about to get started. So why don't we go to the start line and watch these people run their race? Tarnation is that. I think that's a grown man in the cake. Well, I can't knock our friend the superhero. You know that grown man in the cape with the mustache? You know, if I was a man and I had a mustache, I might run in the cape too. These people are just out here having fun, enjoying a healthy lifestyle and a good workout. Well, I found Lady and Chloe. They're right here. We'll see you guys in two hours and 37 minutes. Keep up the good work. At an event like the Shiner Beer Run, this is the time of day where family members and supporting runners just kind of hang out, enjoy the scenery, sit around and wait. Well, instead of sitting around, Ryan went looking for coffee. 
He walked around and asked some people where to find some coffee, and they were kind enough to explain, Sir, this is a beer place. We don't have coffee. If you want coffee, you might have to walk down to Main Street and grab a cup of one of those little diners. This lady and Chloe are pretty quick on their feet these days. They may be at the finish line before too much time passes. Might be a good idea to hang out here. So let's take a quick look at where these guys will be finishing the race. They're going to come in from the course, cross the bridge, over the creek, and into the brewery. Kind of a neat finish line. Nice way to finish a half marathon, I think. Half marathon isn't the only event going down today. After the half started, we had a 10K and a 5K kickoff. When those runners entered the course, you can see they're already coming back. Coming back pretty quick, but it won't be long. We'll see Lady and Chloe cross the finish line in no time at all. Thank you, families. We love you. Baby jogger coming down. Hey, Ryan. I think I see Chloe coming. Chloe! Yep, that's definitely Chloe. And that girl's moving. Look at her across the finish line. Good job, Chloe. Good job, lady. Run like the wind. Man, this town so wholesome kind of gives you a toothache, doesn't it? It's been a long time since you've seen people gather like this. Well, ladies, I bet it feels pretty good to finish a half marathon and enjoy a beautiful day in Shiner, Texas. Good work. <laughs>